GoFundMe shuts down $1 million fundraiser for celebrity Amber Heard. GoFundMe has helped millions to raise funds for worthy causes and is highly commended by many but has also been criticized in the past for taking time to shut down fake pages. However, this time around it has acted swiftly and cracked down on pages that are seeking to capitalize on the recently concluded Johnny Depp Amber Heard celebrity trial. Both of them slap defamation suits on each other and both have to pay damages to each other, as per the Wednesday verdict. GoFundMe swiftly removed a page that was phony. The justice for Amber Page claimed that it was trying to raise $1 million for Amber Heard so that she could pay damages to Johnny Depp, her ex-husband. Amber's lawyers had said that the Aquaman star would be unable to pay the huge amount of $15 million in damages. After the verdict where Amber Heard was asked to pay substantial damages, a person called Kimberly Moore set up the page. The person said that they had contacted the celebrity actress' legal team and promised that direct access of the funds raised would reach Amber. The page description, created by Kimberly Moore, read as follows. I believe Amber and social media protected the abuser. The judgment exceeds her net worth. It's so sad that he was able to get away with the abuse. The judgment furthers that abuse. If you can please help her. A spokesperson for GoFundMe told TMZ that they were able to flag the page and take down the profile very quickly before it could raise a large amount of money. They found out that neither Amber Heard nor any member of her team had created the page. So, they shut down the page. The site also said that they would continue to look out for fake profiles and pages and act on them. Amber's lawyer has said that the celebrity is unable to pay the $8.35 million to celebrity ex Johnny Depp. However, her team also confirmed that no one had set up a GoFundMe page.